Happy New Year, Scott here with Mr. Tool Junkie. I wanted to talk today about a new screwdriver set that I got from PB Swiss Tools. I've been interested in the brand after seeing a couple of YouTube videos out there and thought I would uh, get a set to check it out. I wanted to get a set of screwdrivers to start and what I was interested in was something that was compact, gave a lot of functionality, and a lot of different options for different applications all in one set. So PB Swiss actually has a set of screwdrivers that comes in this nice tool roll. And it's a vinyl tool roll with some sewn-in stitching. Uh, it's really nice, um, higher quality tool roll. And in the tool roll, there's a number of different screwdriver blades. Uh, on the large size, they all run from a Torx T10, 15, 20, and 25. You have a 4, 5, and 6 hex. There's a Posi Drive number 2, a Phillips number 2. There's a square tipped Remy Now. And then in the flatheads or slotted screwdrivers, there's a 2, 3, 4, and 5. You get a handle. This is the PB Swiss 8215 handle. And this is the handle that has a textured, kind of a rubberized grip to it. Feels really nice in the hand. Um, if your hands are slippery from oil or grease or something, it, it allows you to still be able to grip the screwdriver pretty securely. Um, really nice handle in, in the in the set. In addition to the main blades, it comes with this little testing screwdriver. So you can test circuits to make sure that they're working. And then there's a micro driver set with a telescoping handle. And this actually can detach from the main tool roll and become its own little tool roll with a strap. So if you wanted to keep it out of the main kit or just were working on some electronics or small items, you can actually just use this particular tool roll. And within the telescoping tool roll, you've got all your Torx bits that go from a size 6 uh, on the small side all the way up to a size 9. Then you've got your 0 uh, and 1, number 1 Phillips. You've got a 2.5 and, and a 3 hex. You have a one and a half and a two inch hex. Well, a couple of flat and Phillips combination blades that go down to the micro size. And then you've got three combination flat and Phillips bladed ends for the micro driver. And then the handle itself is just the standard PB Swiss handle. It's got a rotating cap and then this little knurled uh, clip on the end allows you to put the screwdriver bit in. And what's unique about this particular style is the screwdriver bits can come in all the way here and you tighten it down and you have a, a small driver, you can loosen the knurling and actually extend this out so that you can get a more traditional length screwdriver, which is really nice for working on certain electronics where the recessed screw head might be inside of a molding or a plastic casting in a short length micro driver, which is typically what um, they're smaller in length when you get a, a smaller size driver like this and, and it makes it impossible to reach into a deep cavity to remove some of the screws from 
a piece of electronics, so that's pretty nice. Feels good in the hand, and it's just a nice um, all-round set to have access to. And then everything is secured with these little uh, elastic holding, and everything's really secured with this this elastic, which is nice. And then it just snaps back in to the actual main part of the tool roll. On the blades themselves, on the main blades, these all have um, some knurling on the end, which is really nice. And every PB Swiss tool, or I should say most PB Swiss tools, actually have the uh, serial number etched or laser laser stamped on the steel so that PB Swiss knows exactly what lot of steel uh, this particular tool is made from. So they all have an individual serial number. Not sure if this, there you go. And then the size and everything is stamped on the actual head. And it's got a little ball detent on the end here. And then these little fins line up with the handle. So that when you insert the bit, it's really secure. And you can um, you can just hear that and you need the knurling actually to be able to remove that. That's, that's in there really quite securely. And then you have your traditional driver. There's not a lot of backlash in this mechanism. There's a little bit of play, but not, um, not much at all. And for a kit that's compact and pretty versatile, I think PB Swiss hit the mark on this one. Now you can add a number of other blades to the set if you wanted. They have some additional sizes and most of the blades, I believe. And I'm likely going to add a couple of additional Phillips heads at some point and maybe a couple of other hex heads um, to go along with the set. I did actually purchase a couple of their quarter inch nut drivers, they're hex, hex heads, and they have two different lengths available. So I opted for um, getting that, and then I actually did buy another one of the multi-grip handles as well to go with the set. That way, if I'm using like a, a slotted screwdriver and a Phillips, for example, I can have both of those working without having to keep interchanging the blades between the one handle. So it just makes it a little bit more convenient. The nut drivers, they fit in the exact same way as the regular blades. The main difference is that these nut drivers do not have the knurling on the end, but they take just the uh, normal quarter inch hex bits that are pretty typical. So this is a PB Swiss slotted. This is a one by five and they're magnetized on the end. And typical with PB Swiss, the magnets are quite strong. Uh, you can listen to this. Hear that click, like that's just really in there securely. These are the long bits, the E6 series bits. I ordered um, some of the smaller bits, but they're all on back order right now, so hope to get those in soon. But I did get a couple of um, Torx bits. I use a lot of Torx, T15s, T20s, T25s mainly. So I did get some some of the Torx bits that PB Swiss makes, and they're just uh, really nice tooling.
The other thing that PV Swiss makes uh, are these nut drivers. And this is the metric, they, they sell them in metric. And this goes all the way from a five millimeter all the way up to a 13 millimeter. And just really uh, super high quality for a nut driving set. Uh, the machining is just another level. Um, again, everything is stamped on the side with the size has a serial number on it. And I got these, uh, they actually don't come with these little clips. You can actually purchase these from PB Swiss as an add-on accessory. They're not very expensive at all. It's actually probably the cheapest thing that PB Swiss makes, but they actually can hold 10 different hex bits to keep them all organized. And then I, I used them actually to, to store the uh, hex-headed sockets as well, just to keep them organized. Now obviously with the diameter of the bit at the end, you can't fit them all right next to each other. There has to be a little bit of a space between them, which is uh, why I have them spaced every other one. And actually I have two of them to fit the full set, but these keep them all nice and secure in my tool bag or toolkit and just adds more functionality to the overall kit. They are also magnetized on the end with their own magnets and it's typical PB Swiss, just super strong um, magnet. And you can see <laughs> this is just the a hex head stuck in the end of a M8 and it's lifting up the entire thing on its own. And then they'll just fit it right in the end. And you can see the little magnet. And within the tool roll itself, there is actually another pocket here on the side, which I've never actually tried this, but I'm gonna to try to fit my additional handle in here, see if that works. This is where the handle that comes with the set goes. And then there's space for the nut drivers. And then it rolls all up. And it looks like it's just barely going to fit. There we go. Just enough room to, to fit this. So this concludes my overview of the PV Swiss Tools 8515 all-rounder screwdriver set with the roll-up case. If you like this video, please click the like button and consider subscribing. And I wish you all a happy new year. Thank you so much for watching.